Oh, yeah. Revelation? Revelation, that's Okay, right. yeah, I'm like, wait a minute, Reflection? Come on now. That sounds a little bit too not cynical for Bill Hicks. Yeah, right. Reflections. The Bill Hicks Comedy Hour. I've been thinking, people. Our world is just too hard. We need to be nice to one another. <laughs> Look at that thing. That's like Bloody Mary. Dude, how scared of Bloody Mary were you when you were a kid? Not at all, dude. Really? I was... I was always the fucking kid who would call bullshit on that stuff. <laughs> My friends would be like, dude, I heard there's, like, trolls that live in this forest. I'm like, yeah, what's their deal? And they're like, if you close your eyes and walk backwards, like, for five feet, they'll attack you. And I'll just go out there like, oh, here we go. Oh, look, no trolls. Fucking bullshit. <laughs> and they're all like, Jesus died for your sins. I'm like, yeah, that's bullshit, too. And they're like, Chris, I don't think we can hang out anymore. I'm like, okay. Yeah. I went to cool. Catholic school, man. Like, that's... I'm sorry. Yeah, right? Do everybody I know who went to Catholic school ended up growing up to be either atheist or Wiccan. <laughs> like, what are, what are the fucking odds? Like, you guys did this way wrong somehow. <laughs> like, like, we've got this really great teaching curriculum that, you know, has like a 100% fail rate. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and the fail rate has two differing degrees of awful, like, depending on your point of view. The thing that I kind of don't like about... Oh, my God. Dude, he's got some sexual. serious tongue. Ah, oh, you dick. See, okay, this is like sometimes... That's the, fucking awesome. The place I'll get hit. Yeah, dude. That's, that was awesome. See, that's the one thing I don't like about him. Like, the, the mini bosses are, like, cool. Like, that guy was pretty cool and everything. Yeah. But I just kind of hate how anticlimactic the ending is. Just like, yep. dead, next scene, all right. Dead and moving along. Look at this shit. Let's see Sega do that. Sega would be shitting itself right now. You'd um, see a Genesis fucking sweating. It would be like, oh, my God. Dude, he'd just be Holy spinning. shit. Holy Blast shit. Processing. Yeah, Processing. that's true. He'd be fucking spinning around, hitting spikes and shit on the <laughs> now, side. Now, the first time you play this game, you're probably going to fuck this up a lot. I know I did. Because it doesn't give you any indication as to where the fuck you're supposed to go. This is the, the Chris Curtis dad talk hour? Yeah, basically. You're not going to have the experience that I do. See, you don't know that thing's going to come out for you. No. Oh. You're kind of like, oh, shit. No, I totally would have jumped, like, two minutes ago. No, like, down into that hole, because it looks like the next... Yeah, and then this part, like, like well, oh, shit, see. can I walk on that? Like, oh, yeah, you can. Okay, what the fuck? <laughs> Check this shit out. Take that, oh, Sega. Yeah. You go kill yourself, Sega. You cannot compete on that one. Yeah, there's a lot of hate going on in this room right Dude, now. Dude, I love Sega, too, but oh, still. Like a, I feel like we need a safe space here. <laughs> Dude, everybody needs a safe space. <laughs> How does everybody in our audience of two feel about safe spaces? Please leave your notes in the comments below about safe spaces. About how much of a pussy you are. <laughs> you ever, like, mistype the word warrior? I'm, I'm thinking social justice warrior, but I always mistype it to Wario. <laughs> it's like Wario <laughs> with, like, some extra, you know? You ever mistype Wario. it? Wario! Wario. No, I'm just more used to, like, not carrying a smartphone oh. and using T9 on my phone and, like, yeah. having, it, having it pop up with, like, the most random and sometimes oh. extremely racist and offensive. Um, <laughs> like when I was sending know, like, you those text messages of just, like, whatever my auto-predict suggested for the next well, word is like, what I'm sending you. Yeah, and it's, like, with, uh, like, I work with dogs for a living, so a lot of times I'm talking to somebody about, like, oh, a puppy, and my phone really likes to reference pussy a lot. <laughs> and uh, for a while, every time that I typed in early, <laughs> the first option it would give me was darkies. So, oh yeah. That's not good. Yeah. I'm, I'm a little worried about my phone's morality. Go, 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 go. All right, fucking Blackthorn would have died like six times in there. <laughs> There's no fucking way Kyle could have walked through that oh, shit. Kyle. Kyle McGraw Blackthorn. Man. All I gotta say though is that the uh, the early '90s, the 16-bit era, really was uh, really was great for hair. You know, like nowadays, it's all about product. You watch some, you watch some, you play some Final Fantasy games, and it's like, oh, dude, that's they, all they, gel, yeah, it's all dude, gel it's all and styling. Gel. This, this is all, this is hard work. Combing your hair. Couple hundred times in the morning. Man, look at that shit. What the fuck? Oh yeah, that's right. We're that guy has got plaque psoriasis like a motherfucker. <laughs> Poor guy. Get this guy some ointment quick. He's pretty noble. He's pretty oh. nipple though. I mean, 
Well, yeah, dude, you've got to be. You need to be able to run away in shame when everybody sees your skin at the public fair. Haven't you seen those commercials? <laughs> Bam! Got a chain dick! It's dangling. It's <laughs> just straight dangling.